Mount Etna has once again erupted violently. From a height of more than 2,000 meters above sea level, the vent near Mount Simone continues to spew incandescent lava relentlessly, as if the bowels of the earth were opening and releasing deadly heat. According to the Italian National Institute of Geology and Volcanology, this lava flow is moving slowly but steadily down the southern slopes toward Rocca Musara, now at an altitude of about 1,580 meters. On the surface, monitoring instruments show a deceptive calm. Seismic and infrasound networks have recorded no significant readings, as if the mountain is still. GNSS data and the slope of the ground are stable, raising no concerns. But beneath this calm, strain gauges are registering a slight decompression trend, a sign that magma is continuing to flow, the pressure gradually decreasing like the deep breath of an awakening giant. The scene, captured by 24-hour live cameras, conveys a silent horror. Glowing red lava flows in the darkness, producing a thick haze and smoke that hangs in the air. Each wave of lava seems alive, pulsating and moving at its own pace. The air around the mountain seemed to vibrate with heat, while the sky above Etna was gloomy, as if witnessing something that should not be disturbed. There was no massive explosion. Nothing exploded. That's precisely what made it terrifying. This effusive eruption was a reminder that disaster doesn't always come with a loud bang. Sometimes, destruction moves slowly, silently, and consistently. Mount Etna wasn't on a cliff, it was at work carrying out its natural cycles without regard for anything in its path. The ceaseless dynamics of the lava, the subtle changes in the atmosphere, and the unpredictability of the volcano's behavior. For those watching, the scene was both captivating and unsettling. The fires blazing in the darkness of the night served as an undeniable reminder. Beneath human feet, the earth is alive and its power far exceeds human control. Today, Mount Etna once again demonstrated its devastating power. For the past week, Europe's highest and most active volcano has experienced a violent eruption, spewing streams of hot lava from its depths. The sky over the island of Sicily darkened, filled with thick smoke and towering volcanic ash creating a tense atmosphere for local residents. A loud rumbling sound erupted from Etna's crater, followed by a torrent of incandescent material that burned like hellfire. Glowing red lava flowed slowly but steadily, devouring everything in its path. The night was illuminated by the eerie glow of the lava, as if the earth were splitting open and revealing its deepest depths. Small tremors were felt in nearby settlements, awakening residents in fear. Local authorities immediately raised the alert level. Several areas around the volcano's slopes were temporarily closed, and flights were disrupted due to the widespread volcanic ash. Fine ash-coated roads, rooftops, and vehicles, creating a desolate and gloomy landscape. The air was filled with a pungent sulfuric odor, making breathing difficult. Volcanologists stated that Etna's activity this time was unusually intense, although still within its usual eruptive pattern. However, uncertainty remained. The constantly moving lava flow could change direction at any time increasing the risk to areas previously considered safe. Tension has gripped residents living near this giant volcano. Etna is known as an active volcano, always active and never truly asleep. This eruption once again reminds us how small and fragile we are in the face of the power of nature. Behind Sicily's natural beauty lies a threat that could emerge at any moment 
To this day, monitoring continues 24 7 The world holds its breath, waiting to see if Etna will calm down or unleash an even greater fury. One thing is certain. This week's eruption has left a deep sense of fear and served as a terrifying reminder of the power of nature beyond human control.